Hello everybody on YouTube, this is Ahoy here. Uh, I already apologize for the inferior sound quality because I forgot a cable back home and uh, I can't record the output from my sound card so I have to use the built-in microphone for all the sounds. So for today's lesson we have how to use a bow coder in Cubase. To do this you need a free plugin called uh, MDA Vocoder. Uh, it's a freebie and it works on both PC and Mac. It's a VST plugin. And what it needs is a voice input and something uh, as a carrier input. So I will make a new instrument track and choose Tal Electro. It's a free monophonic synth. You can download it online. It's here. And what it sounds like is like like that. And then what I will do is that I will record some voice so I can uh, demonstrate how the vocoder works. You can do it on the fly also, but uh, because of the situation here I won't be doing that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You could also sing or whatever and then you need to make a bus. Sorry, a, a group channel. I'm still in the Pro Tools mode here. So, and route that to the bus, and pan it to the left, and then route this to the same group, and pan it to the right. And on the group track, I have the free plugin here, it's on the vocoder, and on the modular input I have it on the right by default. So what I now need to do is to use the synth and when I press play I should be able to modulate the sound with the on-screen keyboard. Okay, and that is how you use a vocoder. You can use anything for the instead of the synth, you can use a say import audio file. Let's take one of my songs, for example. Let's route that to the right and go into the same group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten. So that is how you use a vocoder. Thank you for watching. Uh, uh, spread the word and make good music.